the competition, that's all. Any disappointment about the end, way the end of the game played out, you know, giving up the score and then driving back down again? Uh, I mean, the only thing I can say about that is from from the first snap to the last snap, you just want to be consistent. And that's one thing we've been working on all, all season is consistency. And, you know, we let them get a few plays in the end that – uh, uh, if the game was a little closer, may have may have uh, uh, changed the outcome. So you want to make sure you work on that and just, like I said, continue to finish every play, every run. I think I heard you saying something along the lines of like, you know, we got you when you went over uh, to St. Country Roads. What was that moment when you were sort of giving a message to the fans? I guess, like this yeah, there's a lot of fans out there who believe in us. You know, there are a lot who don't. There are a lot who didn't expect to see what we came on the show today. And I just wanted to let them know, you know, we got you. You know, we all come in and, and fight every day and work every day to put on a performance for them. And, you know, those are who we do it for. You know, those, those are the fans that come support us every day. And, you know, I just want to make sure they, they enjoy themselves. I just want to let them know we got them. Dana said before the game that you guys have heard the naysayers and you've taken it to heart and you've to prove people wrong. How much has that been kind of a part of the battle cry this offseason? Well, I mean, like I said before, it's not necessarily as much as trying to prove people wrong. Is trying to prove those who believe in us right, and that's what that was. You know, run over there to the fans, let them know the ones that believe in us. We got you. you know, we're not gonna let you down. We're gonna get out here, and like I said, fight every day, fight every practice, fight every rep, and get results. Gibby said they uh, didn't necessarily show anything that he wasn't expecting, but they just did it fast. What, what was it like with how many snaps they were just, I mean, in volume? Yeah, I mean, uh, as far as scheme, like I said, Coach Gibby put in a great scheme. You know, we followed this game and it worked well for us. Like you said, the only thing they tried to tempo us a little bit, but we play against the offense as well. You know, we do tempo drills in practice, so we are prepared for it. That's, you know, there's nothing not else to say to that one. We are prepared for it. Sure. Talk about the confidence that you had in yourselves. To see it actually play out and have the success in a game that counts, what can that do for you? Uh, going forward, man, like you said, it just builds confidence. It, 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 uh, for the most part, we knew we could do it. And for those that didn't know we can do it, we showed them we can do it, you know? So I think it'll be a big confidence builder going into uh, going into next week. Can't wait to watch the film, correct the mistakes, and get ready for our next game uh, tomorrow tomorrow night. What's up? No Alan, what kind of your red zone defense? Is that again? What kind of your red zone defense today? What happened? Good. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't necessarily say what happened. I mean, we, we, we did what we had to do, bro. You know, Coach Gibby put in a great scheme. <laughs> Coach Gibby put in a great scheme, and, you know, everybody was in position. We went through those those red zone plays and stuff like that all weekend. We just made the plays that were in front of us. You knew it was coming? So, like I said, Coach Gibby scheme, man, it doesn't matter what play you run. Who you line up out there, what personnel. We run the scheme the way he draws it up, and everybody will be in position to make a play.